Hello and welcome back to a page-by-page -page review of Dune by Frank Herbert. Today is page 670. It is a great page in which um, Gurney Halleck is reunited with Paul and Paul takes this as a great omen that he is uh, with his old swordsmaster and that this is a sign of uh, good fortune for them, especially as they are headed ever and ever more towards war and escalation of that war with the Harkonnens. And that uh, Paul asks him about the men of his crew. Gurney says out loud that uh, they are smugglers and they stand where the prophet is. But then hand signals that there are men that cannot be trusted amongst them. And Paul pulls out his lip indicating that uh, he understands and that um, then Paul introduces Granny Halleck, who is his old friend, to Stilgar, who is uh, of the Fremen tribe. And this is a great uh, uniting of two different worlds surrounding Paul. And Stilgar says, of course, I hear you are his duke. And that Paul had introduced him after saying he of all these stories and that this is the man from his old life and Stilgar says that and it's a bit cryptic and it is similar to that of people in real life when your friends worlds are uniting so perhaps you have a roommate and then you have friends and then they are mixing um, worlds are colliding in the great words of and I know we're trying to limit to just do by Frank Herbert but of, of noted philosopher George Costanza from the television series uh, Seinfeld who's played by Jason Alexander the Worlds are colliding, and we're going to see how they collide. Let us know if there are any worlds in your life colliding and how they rack up, stack up to Dune by Frank Herbert, 670 tomorrow, 671.